Welcome to Bob's Week in Review with our brand new state-of-the-art intro sequence. Today is July 29th, 2011, and I am your host, Bob. Our first newscast this week is about our usual topic, the government, and the bickering that they are doing amongst themselves. It has actually been noted that their cooperation is similar to a three-year-old kid. Anyways, enough of that. I am quite excited about next year's election. When I get an opportunity to vote every single one of them out, or at least every single one that's in my district. But nonetheless, an opportunity, a thrilling excitement that we should all take part in. And I don't know how to finish this statement. The end. This past week, researchers at the University of Oxford have discovered something that we robots have known for years. And that is, tequila is a wonderful biofuel. The researchers did not go into detail of how much or when we could expect tequila fuel pumps, but I am getting excited just thinking about it. And for Nintendo fans, the 3DS price has been slashed, coming down from $250 a unit to only $170. A great bargain. And Nintendo is coming out with some fantastic games, like Star Fox 64, Mario Bros. 3D, and a few others. I believe in Mario Kart. My question is, why are all these handheld systems from Nintendo always going back to the 60, Nintendo 64 version games? Are they lazy? Can they not program anymore? Do they just have to scale down the screen size and call it quits? And finally, we come to some fluff news for the end of our program. Netflix doesn't give a damn if you don't like their pricing scheme. They are on a mission to kill the DVD. More power to them on that quest. Most people have already moved to Blu-rays. But you kill that DVD, Netflix. You kill it. Also, in China, there is several Apple stores popping up everywhere. They're fake. With possibly fake merchandise inside. Well, that concludes our program for the week. I hope you enjoyed it. And so long. Have a great week. And don't forget, subscribe to our program. We cannot last unless you subscribe. We need more people to keep this show running.